before we get into today like the goddamn video now for those who watched last night's miami heat versus lakers game the miami heat came into this game being one of the best offensive and defensive teams in the league and most people expected this game to be a landslide the way the lakers have been playing but the lakers pulled it together without lebron james and made a big upset in an overtime victory russell westbrook and anthony davis played like the stars we know they are and guys like avery bradley wayne ellington stepped up too but the biggest takeaway from this game was malik monk malik monk had a season high 27 points along with six rebounds and three assists shooting from the field at 76 percent and from the three at 57 percent malik monk was sensational last night and gave this lakers team a new edge we did not think they had after last night's game the lakers looked and played like the team we expected them to be and they have a secret weapon in malik monk that makes them even more dangerous than we thought and we're going to dial in on that today but before we do i need you guys to subscribe to the channel there are about 90 percent of you guys who watch and don't subscribe so do that real quick for me and like the video too but enough talking bro let's get it so malik monk for the season averages 8.7 points two rebounds 1.9 assists shooting from the field at 45 percent and from the three at 38 percent in the 21 minutes a game he gets we recognize him as a potential young star coming out of charlotte and going into the season was playing a new role coming off the bench for this time a championship contending team where i think is most impressive is how much malik monk has embraced his role as this is something a lot of young guys i feel will struggle with but from day one malik monk has made a smooth transition to this team and that game last night was a breakout one waiting to happen because this man is truly skilled malik monk last night was in full control and it seemed as if every bucket he made the basket became bigger and bigger from the opening tip was in attack mode and was displaying his offensive talent that a lot of people didn't know he really had what makes malik monk so special is if he needs to he can just be a straight bucket getter and plays guys one-on-one -on -one. and that's something this lakers team lacked as other than Melo, malik monk is really the only guy off the bench who can consistently create his own he doesn't need anything from anyone else to do so all he needs is the ball one four flat everyone get the hell out the way and this man can cook and he did it multiple times down the stretch faced with a lot of one-on-ones and towards the end of the game they started throwing double teams at him and guess what that didn't even phase him because he was still able to score and what makes him so dangerous in a one-on-one -on -one is his ability to hit some tough shots and to him it's not tough because when he's hot no amount of good defense matters it's just about whether he misses or not and him scoring ability isn't only about him having the ball he's perfectly fine with being a catch and shoot player because this man is a sniper and for most part of the year that's what he's been with russell westbrook and lebron leading the offense it helps to know malik monk is not one dimensional as he can put the ball on the floor and take guys to the basket or hit those long range shots mellow scoring ability off the bench is one thing and then you add malik monk who like i said is a straight bucket getter and when he's hot like we saw last night he can be the x factor in the game and in transition malik monk becomes a high iq player he understands the situation always finds a way to make the best play and a lot of the time that is through his passing actually we know this lakers team plays quick once they get the rebound especially westbrook they try to run the floor and malik monk aids in that department it's not just his offensive scoring ability and shutting out his teammates he knows how to find them especially in transition and fits what the lakers have been doing for a while now and defensively Malik Monk brings solid defense to this team. He can keep up with the perimeter guys one on one and is great when it comes to playing passing lanes. This team definitely needed some better perimeter defenders and Malik Monk is consistently that. He's a better defender than he is an average one, I'll say that. Malik Monk gives this Lakers team a dangerous edge as when this team finally comes together and all the pieces are finally starting to match, this is going to be fun to watch and it hopes even more that the Lakers have a young star in Malik Monk. For the most part, the rest of this roster, we know what they are, we know what they are about, we know what they bring to the table, there's nothing new with them. But Malik Monk is growing as a player himself and we don't know how good he can be, but we know he has the star potential and is showcasing that right in front of our eyes for his Lakers team. Malik Monk is a hidden gem he is the secret weapon for the los angeles lakers i definitely want to know what you guys think about this so in the comments let me know what you think about malik monk don't forget to follow me on my instagram and i'll see you guys later